welcome to another episode of Watch Once Over. My name is Big E. Today we're going to be looking at this beautiful Daniel Jean Richard uh, Retropont uh, Chronograph. Now this is available at ArizonaFineTime.com right now. And if you're interested in this piece, contact those guys, ask for Colin, and, um, and he'll give you a nice uh, price and deal on this watch. Now... Um, before we check out this uh, Rotra Ponce, um, here's a little bit more about Arizona Fine Time. Arizona Fine Time is located in Scottsdale, Arizona, and I'll leave a link to the website in the description. They stock many, many luxurious and great brands like Maurice Lacroix, Seiko, Seiko Lux, Tutima, Luminox, Laco. Mule Glasut and exclusive brands like High End G Shock, Accutron, Ball, and many, many others. Come check us out and you're going to love what you see. Thanks. Okay, guys, we're back. Now we're looking at this beautiful Retropont uh, chronograph. Now, this is going to be a 7750 Valjo based chronograph uh, tuned up by Daniel Roth. And this is a holy grail of complications is a split mechanical chronograph. Now, if you look right above 6 o'clock, you'll see it says chronograph or retropont automatic. So it is an automatic split chronograph. That's what that basically translates into. And, and while we're up close, I'll go ahead and start the split chronograph to show you how it works. You start it right here. And you see the chronograph uh, working. Now, if you want to get the split time, there's also a button right here within the crown. Now, I'll do that at 15 seconds. Boom. That's the first time. And as you can see, the second time is still running. Now, about half past, I'll stop that one and I'll show you how it works. Now, that's the second time. So if you were timing, say, two racers, and it was a 15 minute interval in between. One came in at 15 seconds, the other at 30. That's how you uh, you can tell the difference. Now to get them lined back up, you press the rotor point again, then they go back together, and then you reset. Now you're back to your normal chronograph. And if you want, you don't have to use a split time. You can just use it as a normal chronograph too. As you can see, it works exactly like a normal chronograph, just with that added benefit of a split time there, which is, like I said before, an extremely hard uh, complication to achieve. And many watchmakers don't do this uh, be because of this fact. Now, on this dial, it all it's all printed in this beautiful navy blue against the eggshell uh, white uh, dial. You have your running seconds over here at 9 o'clock, your 30-second totalizer here. And, of course, your split time hands and these beautiful, beautiful, lovely syringe style hour and minute hand. Now, this watch is a beautiful uh, tunnel uh, shaped case. And let's do some quick measurements on this. And I'll show you what it looks like on my wrist. You got about uh, 40 millimeters wide, mm, 14 and a half millimeters thick. Remember, it is a value based movement, so it's going to be a little bit thicker. And then just about 50 millimeters lug to lug. And I'll show you what this looks like on my wrist, which is 7.25 inches. As you can see, it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look bad at all. Now, I don't know if this is going to fit on a dress cuff, but just keep in mind, when you're dealing with these watches, with these um, serious complications, a lot of times they do get on the uh, thick side but not, nonetheless this watch is still beautiful now you get this beautiful uh, crocodile uh, large-scale alligator model stitch um, color strap you get a fold over Daniel Jean Richard signed fully milled swing arm and it's just a press fit and then you get two alligator keepers now this watch is extremely extremely um high quality you get this beautiful sapphire crystal which is domed 
and then the polished bezel. The finishing on this case of, is all of polish, and I think it fits right in uh, m making the watch uh, extremely elegant looking. I, I really, really like that. Um, the printing on here, as you can see, is just not your run of the mill printing. It's really, really nicely done. Down the bottom of, uh, above the six o'clock uh, uh, number, you have the chronograph. Uh, Retropont automatic, which means automatic uh, split chronograph. That's what that means. And then you have this railroad track um, going around for the minutes. And then every five minutes, you have a thicker um, uh, painted on uh, time for each uh, five minutes. So I think that's real nice, too. Now, this watch does carry loom, and I'll show you what that looks like. The hands are equipped with Super Luminova. And that's just going to be really for your transitional loom. And that's what it'll look like coming in from outside. Extremely powerful loom on this one. And that's what it'll look like at nighttime. And as you can see, the hour hand reaches all the way out. I mean, the minute hand reaches all the way out. And so you can get a good... Uh, uh, look at that and at an easy quick glance tell what time it is and you don't you won't struggle with this one to tell the time it's, it's very very defined and refined watch now like I said before this is offered um, at Arizona fine time right now it is in their uh, luxurious pre-owned section and they sell some of the best pre-owned pieces um, in America so Log on, check this out. I'll leave the link in the description. If you're interested in this watch, give him a call, ask for Cullen. He'll give you the complete breakdown of what this is going to cost to get home. So that's a watch once over, over for today. This is a beautiful Daniel Jean Richard Retropont split chronograph. My name is Big E. That's a watch once over for today. I'll talk to you guys later. God bless and thanks for watching.